Hi, Jeff. Do you need something? Mm, nope. Nothing at all. My computer's acting funny, so I figured I'd spend some time bossing. Keep clicking. Don't mind me. Can you, uh, go boss someone else? I'm having a little trouble focusing, that's all. Coffee. Coffee will set you right, Joan. The coffee machine is still broken, but it's not that. It's the grueling pace. We've been working so hard, we're downright frazzled. Yeah, my wrists are killing me from animating. That's just the pain of passion. The passion of fun. We're all too stressed out to remember what fun is. Look at Francine over there. We can't keep pushing like this without a break. A break? Stop fooling around. Everyone knows the turtle wins because it never takes breaks. What turtle? The turtle in that story. Look, I, I know how life works, okay? I've done a lot of it. Taking breaks leads to productivity boosts afterwards. A little time away from the desk would pay dividends. Yeah, dividends. That's a money word. You like money, right? I do like money. Yeah, you can't be a good game developer if you can't remember how to have fun, right? A good bit of fun will galvanize us into turbo mode. Galvanize? Is that a money word too? Sure. Hmm. Galvanize into turbo mode. Hmm. G it, galvanize. Perhaps you're onto something, Joan. I suppose we could use something to spice up the bedroom of the office. I'll ponder this. Hey, quick question. Bigger the fun, bigger the boost? Uh, definitely. It's scientifically certain. Hmm. I'll need help. Now, which one of you all screams fun the most to me? Hey, what the hell? Heads up! We're the fun squad! You got a problem with fun? What the hell are you two doing? Think fast, Francine! Will you quit it? Viper. Personal space, remember? Gah! The Fun Squad doesn't care about personal space. The Fun Squad. Come on, we don't need a Fun Squad. You don't know what you don't need until you finally have it. We're gonna have so much fun, we'll spring three milestones ahead of schedule. If you're not having fun, you're living a lie. Are you living a lie? If I say yes, will you leave? You picked him to be on your Fun Squad. Seriously. Hey! I'm the best there is at fun, and I'm here to galvanize you peasants! Man, you don't even know what that word means. I just learned, okay? I'm the best at learning. I taught him. And I'm getting a free movie ticket out of this. Hey! Stop spoiling the surprises! Only the winners get the tickets. Now, like I always say, you have to put down some primer if you're gonna paint the town. I got surprises for all of you today. Viper, tell everyone to meet in the parking lot in 10 minutes. Yeah, okay, I can do that. But then, that ticket is as good as mine. Okay, okay, I know about Jeff's meeting, now go away. As the senior member of the fun squad, I declare that this thing is not fun, whatever it is. Oh, hello, Mentor! Do you need my help with anything? Can I get you some supplies? Do you need me to pick up anything for you from the office store? Can you show me how to do some cool art? Oh, can I sit by your desk? Uh, no, I, I don't need anything. I, uh, bye. Fun Squad. Viper, really? I've always been on the Fun Squad. You all just don't know what fun is, okay? Hey, Joan. You ready to have some fun? Oh, I'm always having fun. That's the secret to happiness. Sure, but this fun isn't a delusional lie. Let's go. Whatever moon language Kevin was writing here, uh, the sooner we eradicate it, the better. Hey, Dweeb, why are you staring at the fridge? Sally won't give me a soda. Ow, see? The purple tentacle thing? You know you're the only one who goes near the fridge, right? That's because Sally likes me. You all aren't nice to her. Maybe she's feeling sick today? I think she's been hopping around more than usual lately. One of these days, that thing's gonna cause trouble. Whatever. Jeb called a company meeting. Let's go. Ugh, one of Ben's fantasy books. This thing is big enough you get neck problems from reading it.
Fester Face, one of the Wolverine sidekicks from Sweaty Blood 6. Timothy, are you ready to have some fun? I'm sorry, I can't do that. Rubber ducks? I think this is pylons. Yeah, okay, this map is helpful. This little console is the harbinger of fun. Hey, Dweeb. Jeb wants to talk to all of us. Oh, uh, okay. things are happening in the build. I don't have time to play games. I'm preparing for fun. Jeb wants us all to meet him outside. Um, okay. Let's go, everyone. Company meeting time in the parking lot. Ben, we need to talk. What's on your mind, Joan? You're the only one I can trust. You remember Bruce, the boss at that other game studio? So I gave him Jeb's message and showed him the bug transmitter we found, but the conversation didn't end there. Okay. He said their studio didn't plant the bug, but he also knew who made it. Whoever was listening, they were close. So, let's tell the others. Ben, anyone could be compromised. Anyone. Okay, okay. Let's just tell Jeb then, right after this company meeting. Let's go, dweebs! Okay, Viper, we've been waiting for 10 minutes now. Yeah, where is Jeb? Can we go? I was kinda in the middle of something. Hold up, everyone! Welcome to Fun O'Clock! Now, I know we've been pulling long hours, and I can see you all need a recharge. So, it's time for some team building! Uh, what? Now, now, it's just an hour or two. And you have to stay late to make up the time, but you all deserve it. Really, Jeb? Absolutely, Francine. I believe in you. Here are the rules. I've got an undisclosed number of tickets to go see the Racer Chase movie premiere on opening night. Deluxe seating. 
We've got a lineup of contests, games, tests of endurance. It's gonna take all the fun you can muster to win the day. But first, let's start with a little decompression. You decompress so you can compress in more fun. Right. So grab a mat, everyone. It's yoga time. Wait, what? Oh, I love yoga. Oh, me too. Move it, folks. Caress your inner hummingbird of calmness. Hummingbirds are calm. Their hearts beat 1,200 times a minute. Yeah, I'm not doing yoga. I quit the fun squad. All right, everyone. Downward your dog. And hold. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. No, 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 no. No movie ticket is worth this. You know, I could have been a musician. I had a scholarship offer. I could be in a band right now. And I could have a real job at a real office. And Cobra Pose. Be the Cobra you want to see in the world. I am the Cobra. Hey, you three. What's wrong with you all? Yoga helps you sleep at night. Yeah, my eyes are burning from watching this. There's no way I'm sleeping tonight. Spread eagle pose, everyone. That is not a yoga pose. If you think this is fun, you won't believe what's next. Parking lot soccer? That's right. Parking lot soccer. Football to our European friends. Get the balls to the touchdown area to earn points. That's how soccer works, right? First down, people. No, dude, that's how football works. Well, look who's so ooh-la-la -la European. Everyone ready? Chasing balls doesn't sound like fun. I, 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 the fun squad is on tackle duty. Oh, hot damn, I unquit the fun squad. No, no tackling. What problem do you have with fun, woman? Uh, are there teams? Yes, teams of one. You're on your own team. Viper, you're the ref too. I'll be setting up the next event. I got this. <laughs> so, just get the balls to the cones over there. That That's it? Yep, except the balls are wired to explode. Good luck. Oh, hey, Jeb, can Joan and I talk to you about something for, uh, dang it, and he's gone. All right, let's have some fun, you miserable sacks of joy. Gotta move quick before the balls explode. Oof. All right, a point! I'm gonna get ya! I'm gonna get ya! All right, a point! Hey, hey, I got one! You'll never get that ball into the goal! Score! Never get that ball into the goal. Ow! Score! Oh. I'm doing great! <laughs> Fiber, stop that! Fiber, stop that! <laughs> All right, a point! Keep running, fool! Ow, Viper! All right, a point! <laughs> Whoa, I could do that all day! That was fun! Nice work, everyone! Doesn't it just make you itch to get back to work? You all get three points each for participation, except for Francine. Francine. You can't win the game if you don't play. Yep, got it. Thanks for the memo. Come on, Francine. This is the new Racer Chase movie. I heard he has a tank in this one. Really? That changes everything. Yeah? No. Well, don't worry. There's a lot of ways to win points still. We got dance-offs, musical chairs, trivia, hatchet throwing. And no one has said the word of the day yet. The what? It's a confetti-loaded word of the day. And it's worth... Uh, Six points! Jeb, where did all this junk come from? 
exactly how many balls did you rent? 98,998. What? Time for swimming team. Back into the office. I think we'll have to wait until all this is over before we talk to Jeb. Yeah, or take things into our own hands. That was something Bruce told me. The organization that made that bug, they leave that umbrella logo everywhere they go. What do you mean? My guess is that whoever is listening in on us took over one of the neighboring office suites. We should search the lobby for clues. What, you think they're just gonna slap that umbrella logo on a door, literally? Well, you never know. That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. But if you wanna go look around, be my guest. Hey, fun o'clock waits for no one, okay? Actually, you know what? Let me go look around. I've had enough fun for one day. Roger that. I'll cover for you. Uh, right. Okay. Jeb. Whoa. Seriously? A ball pit, Jeb? I promise you all, it's clean. Okay. Cool. Yeah, that was going to be my next question. I got them from a place that rents them out for kids' birthdays. These are kids' birthday balls? Ugh. I thought you said these were clean. Well... I didn't steal them. Ball pits are the definition of fun. Does anyone else's legs feel greasy? Uh, they come that way. Grease for swimming. Now, group up. I want a photo. Ah, come on in, everyone. The ball pit's great. Three points for participation, Pylon. And keep it up, you beautiful people. Jeb, you're going to give us all Listeria. Then it will be the most fun Listeria you've ever had. Three points for Viper for Listeria. Hey, why does he get points for that? Is it because he's on the Fun Squad? I didn't choose the Fun Squad life. It chose me. Fun Squad, can I go to the bathroom? I don't know. Can you? Is that a fun idea? Yeah. And done. What? Oh. Relax, everyone. I'm just joking. Sort of. All right. Photo op is over. That's going out in our recruitment packages. Next event. The 50-meter backstroke. The office is only 40 meters wide. And you can't backstroke in a ball pit. Fine. 40-meter doggy paddle, then. As the company HR representative and the administrator of our health care plan, I veto ball pit swimming. Stop vetoing fun, Francine. Viper, it's OK. There's no shortage of events. Uh, Francine, you're out of the ticket running. Let's keep up the thrills with our next event. To the kitchen. Man. What the hell has gotten into this guy? I don't know, but I don't like it. It's time for the hot dog eating contest, everyone! Ooh, my hour has come! I love hot dogs! I want a clean contest, everyone. No buns, no condiments, no cooking, just hot dog all the way. Well, that's not as fun. Fun is what you make of it, Pylon! Hey, guys. I mean, I'll still do it, and I'll win, too. I want that movie ticket. <laughs> that's the spirit? Guys. Where'd the fridge go? Huh. That's weird. Uh, I'm sure it's nothing. Sally's always hopping around here somewhere. You know her. She normally waits till after the workday, though. You mean that monster roams the office freely at night? She didn't seem to be feeling too good today. Maybe she hates the smell of hot dogs? All I smell is... coconut? That's me! Coconut sunscreen. Your nose is deserved to have a good time, too. And now it's time for the hot dogs! I'm gonna go figure out what's up with this missing fridge. Then you can kiss those movie tickets goodbye. Yeah, that's okay. That fridge should be around here somewhere. Oh, something just touched my foot. Is something in here with me? Oh, a star duck. Those are special. Timothy, can you tell me where the fridge went to? I'm sorry. I can't do that. You know, I never take any time to play this little thing. night. Uh, never on the same day, though. It's kind of remarkable how much they keep missing each other. 
Oh, something just grazed my leg. Hmm. Is that Sally wandering around? Sally is here, but still no fridge. The door to the dumbwaiter room is open. That's strange. Should I go in? Oh, no. Oh, that can't be good. I have to go tell the others. You cheated, Viper! Oh, uh, well, uh, well, you just got out eaten, punk. You can't eat Ted at once. You have to eat them cereally. I don't know what that means, but it wasn't in the rules, so I get the points. How many points do I get? I... Uh, Twelve. Why is that worth more than the soccer game? That soccer game was dangerous. Hot dog eating is dangerous, too. I think I damaged my liver. You'll have to step up if you want to win. We've got more activities coming up. Jeb, what is the point of all this? Uh, point? Can't this just be an altruistic exercise to show you how much I love the hours you work for me? You'll all have fun, recharge, and get back at it working harder and faster than ever. What? And don't look at me like that. It was Joan's idea. Jeb, just because we get a break doesn't mean we work twice as fast after. Right! It's got to be three times as fast. I already called the investors and trimmed a week off our milestone. Can we just stop this? No one is having fun, and no one wants your movie tickets. Uh, I do. Uh-huh. <laughs> Just how many tickets is an undisclosed number? It wouldn't be undisclosed if I disclosed it. Duh. That number is zero, isn't it? Zero is a number. What? No tickets? Look, the tickets weren't the real reason you all were doing this. Deep down, you regained your sense of fun, employees. <laughs> the fun was a lie! And there's more where that came from. We still have karaoke, musical chairs, the word of the day. But next up is the dance-off. Ooh. You have to outdance me. Anyone mind if I take my shirt off for this? I don't know about you all, but boy, could I really use a break from that guy. Whoa. Joan, is that a Trank gun? Yep. Standard issue. Standard issue from who? We've got bigger things to worry about. Huh. Well, dang it. Joan was right. Whoever these guys are, they're idiots. Hold on. Ben, you don't just want to barge in there. Hmm. Maybe I should come back after hours with Joan. Okay, yeah, that's a problem. Pylon, what is your tentacle doing? Her name is Sally, and she's having a bad day. And she's not my tentacle. She just showed up one morning. I've never seen this much of her. You all think she's got a beak or claws or something up there? Oh, maybe a butt. Although, this explains why she was acting up. Yeah, last time this happened, it was bad. This has happened before? Yeah, Sally only leaves her fridge for one reason. What's that? Laying eggs. Uh, where? Yeah, where, guys? Sally's eggs are about three inches wide. Spherical and, uh... Colorful. Well, crap. I'll get the flamethrower. What happens if they hatch? They can't. They're unstable at this temperature. They explode instead. Why are all the balls exploding today? Why do you all even have a tentacle? Who keeps a tentacle in their office? Oh, 
Were you gonna tell her to move out? You could have called someone? Like an exterminator? I am the exterminator. Piper, stop! There are no problems you can't burn your way through. Those balls could be PVC. You'll fumigate us with vital chloride. <sighs> I'm a man of solutions, okay? We only have a flamethrower and my bat here in the office, and you can't use a bat on a ball. There's another way. Someone has to go in. In... what? Into the ball pit. Swimming. You should go. Sally trusts you. No can do. I just ate, and it hasn't been 30 minutes. Timothy, my man, you want to go? I'm sorry. I can't do that. Well, with that tentacle running around, you can count me out. I'll go. Yeah, well, I guess we can count you out of everything, can't we, Kevin? I said I'll go. Believe me, I'd rather not. But I used to work at an indoor playground. I know my way around a ball pit. Joan, you don't have to do this. Just have some disinfectant ready. Okay, so what does an office tentacle egg look like? This looks weird. I don't think I'm alone down here. I bet this is an egg. <gasps> ah, wolf. Maybe I should try shooting one. <gasps> Who lays exploding eggs? Where are all those eggs coming from? <gasps> Come on, Sally. I know you're here somewhere. <gasps> oh, so you want to play ball, do you, Sally? Well, let's play. I can't let the tentacles touch me. <laughs> It's getting tight in here. Ouch! Oh no! Ouch! Make a hell of a clown omelet with those. Ugh, gross. Is that all of them? I think so. Sally was not happy. You didn't hurt her, did you? No, but she used up all my tranquilizer darts. Heads up, she's on the move. Well, at least she's back in the fridge again. All this fun must have tuckered her out. Or the 35 milligrams of etorphine. Let's get these things into the freezer with the others. The... Others? Oh, yeah. Pylon and I dealt with this once before a long time ago. Yeah, others. It's not like a tentacle is just gonna lay eggs only once, you know? Don't worry, we have plenty of freezer space. Yeah, and next time, we'll handle it too. As a team. Really? You didn't even do anything. Right. Isn't teamwork fun? Okay, look, none of this was fun. Fun is lame. I requit the fun squad. We should all tell each other what we learned today. That'll be fun, too. Stop it, Kevin. I learned about the power of friendship. Okay, sure, that's my answer, too. Are we done here? And I learned how many hot dogs I could eat before I damage my liver. Well, I guess most of us learned that Sally can come out of her fridge. And that she lays eggs. And that they explode. Your turn, Viper. Viper. Oh, fine. I learned what the word galvanize means. <laughs> oh, good job, Viper. All right. Never seen anyone open a door with a blowtorch before. Well, I just brought everything. You never know when you might need a blowtorch. And it's empty? Huh? 
Someone was here. Looks like they had a lot of hardware plugged in here, too, judging by all those power strips. Hmm, looks like they cleared out fast. They did. Huh? Who said that? That air duct grade is talking to us. Man, this is the second time this week. Who the hell are you? And if you say Frank, I'm gonna kick your ass. Who the hell is Frank? Hey, I know that voice. W wait, I do too. Javier? Is that you?